morning, friend. Happy Disneyland day three. Uh, it is about one o'clock and we are starting our day at Cafe Orleans. Uh, I've always wanted to have the Monte Cristo here. I've never had it. Super excited to try this classic Disneyland restaurant. So how can you start a meal at Cafe New Orleans without their mint julep? It's really good. It's super fresh. Oh yeah. So as part of Pixar Fest, they have these little novelty things around the park. You will see this is a straw from Rat Tattoo. It's also a spoon on the bottom. How fun is that? I think this was $5.99, so not too bad when it comes to Disney souvenirs. So for lunch, Sherry ordered uh, one of the Pixar Fest specials they have, Shrimp Rat Tattoo, and it's a three course meal. And the first course that it comes with is actually this bread, cheese, and fruit tray. You guys, look at this table of food that we have here. So here is Sherry's shrimp rat tattoo. That looks amazing. I went with the Monte Cristo and look how huge this is. It looks like four, it looks like two full sandwiches. I got the gumbo that smells great. I can smell it as soon as they brought it. They're gonna share Monte Cristo palm frites. And the mint juleps apparently are refillable. Had the first bite of the Monte Cristo. Unbelievable. You guys, complete amateur mistake. Uh, I did not bring an extra SD card, and at lunch, the SD card I've been filming on for the whole trip filled up, and so we did not get to show you the end of our lunch. Uh, Sherry had beignets, it was delicious. I gotta say, Cafe Orleans was really amazing, and so two thumbs up from all of us. It was so, so good. Now we are grabbing our place for the 3.30 parade, which starts here in about a half an hour. Pro tip, bring an extra SD card. You guys, I had to buy a 32 gig SD card. I'm not even gonna tell you how much it was, but please bring extra SD cards. So one of the amazing treats we've discovered this trip is the grape slush uh, at the coffee cart in Town Square. On hot days, it is perfect. It tastes like basically a frozen grape Jolly Rancher. And with uh, the sun shining, this is perfect. And this is another one of those Pixar Fest treats. Um, of course, if you know the movie Up, the grape soda. This is the grape soda slush. So probably the last time this trip that we will walk through the castle. So if you didn't know, walking through the castle, heading back towards the Fantasyland, on the left-hand side there's an entrance that lets you go up into the castle, walk around, read a bunch of the story, and see a bunch of the scenes. This little boy dressed in the prince costume, trying to pull out the sword. Might be the greatest thing I've seen all day at Disneyland. So we are back here at the Red Rose and I am going to get Gaston's famous brew. It's an apple mango punch topped with passion fruit foam. That sounds amazing. But we already started drinking this, sorry. It's delicious, super refreshing. Uh, I thought it was gonna be more of an apple freeze down here, but it really is just like a mango apple juice. And then up top is that passion fruit whipped cream. It's really fresh, it is really good though. And as we get ready to leave Disneyland for the day and for the last time this trip, uh, we stopped by Walt's apartment here above the fire department and say goodbye. For those of you who don't know, this was uh, the apartment Walt had for himself here in the park. And you'll see the light right there in the middle window, always on for Walt. Okay.
Disneyland as always. You are amazing and fun and we cannot wait to come back and see you. Uh, if you have not been to Disneyland during Pixar Fest, come here and see it. Lots of great food, lots of great parades. Uh, everything that is going on is just a ton of fun. So thanks for joining us on another Disneyland adventure and we'll see you in a couple days as we start our Disney cruise vlogs. Sherry, any Disney parting thoughts? We had a lot of fun. Another great trip to Disneyland. Yep. So before we left the park, we stopped by the Jolly Holiday and picked up these raspberry macarons. Again, part of Pixar Fest. Look how great they look. But you guys, this is just terrible. Disney, do you see the hair right there on top of the macaron? Blah. So we're probably going to just not eat that part. We'll eat this part. It does look good, apart from the hair. Yeah.